how to extract vector data from OpenStreetMap in QGIS. Like for example, those streets of Paris from OpenStreetMap in QGIS. This is what we are going to learn in this tutorial. Welcome to GeoCarto, a channel dedicated to GIS, cartography and geoscience. So subscribe if you want to get more tutorials. So here I opened QGIS and I have downloaded the OpenStreetMap as a base map. So if you don't know how to do this, uh, please watch my video on how to add a base map on QGIS. So I will start by downloading the plugin that we will be using in this tutorial. Go to plugins and then click manage and install plugins. Here we will look for quick OSA. So this is the plugin that we'll be using. We'll click on in install plugin. Plugin is being installed by QGIS. So before opening quick OSM, we should zoom in to the area of interest that we want to download its data. After that, we will go under vector and we will click quick OSM. Here we should input the type of data that we want to import, for example, streets, roads, buildings, etc. For my case, I will be uploading the streets of this area of Paris. In my case, I want to extract the streets of, the, of this area of Paris. So I will type in streets and there we go. I will click on highways and streets so we go we got our data imported we'll go here and we will specify the area of interest we'll click canvas extent and under advanced this is a very important step in fact we should specify the type of the data that we want for, for my case those are streets so corresponding to mostly to lines so I will uncheck points multi-line strings and multi polygons so after that I will just run the query now QGIS is processing the data we got our street I'll just uncheck the base map as you can see right here I will just change the color of the streets to highlight them red apply and then okay so here we got our reads now we can import this vector layer as for example a shape file to do further special analysis to do this go to the imported layer and right click and then click export click save features as and here we will check this shape file here you can name your your shape file and then you can specify where you want to to save it click save and then okay now you have your layer exported as a shape file you can share it or do further special analysis so thanks for watching if you got some value from this video please like it and subscribe if you want more tutorials.